Hi, this is the History of Israel podcast, an Eat My Own Beat podcast. Over the coming weeks, months, and years, we'll be discussing the history of Israel. This is not a podcast to say which side is right, which side is wrong. It's not a podcast to talk about the war which is happening in Palestine. It's just simply the history of Israel. Welcome back to episode 19 of the History of Israel podcast. The early Roman period, from 63 BCE to 70 CE. After Pompey's conquest of Judea in 63 BCE, Hyrcanus II assumed the role of the Anthenarch. However, his advisor of Antipater was ruler in practice and managed the kingdom's affair. Some cities which were conquered by the Hamosians were removed by, from Judean rule, including Azotos, Jaffa, Samaria, as well as Sithopolis, and several cities in Transjordan, which formed the semi-autonomous Decapolis. Hyrcanus II's rule was unstable. Alexander II, Aristobulus II's son, raised a large army and seized Jerusalem, forcing Hyrcanus to leave the city. The Roman general Aulus Gabinus invaded Judea in retaliation, sent Hyrcanus back to Jerusalem and reinstated him as high priest. When Caesar's civil war broke out, Julius Caesar attempted to install Aristobulus on the throne. However, Aristobulus was poisoned and his son Alexander was preparing to support him, was beheaded at Antinoch at the command of Pompey. Antipater and his sons Basil and Herod gained status and power in the, as the ex- expanse of the Hamosian dynasty wanting power, wanting power. When the Perinthians invaded the area in 400 BC, uh, 40 BCE, they installed Antoninus II Matthias, Aristobulus II's youngest son, as king. Faisal committed suicide, and Hyrcanicus II was taken as prisoner to Babylon after having his ear room severed in order to prevent him from ever acting as high priest again. Herod, who fled the Perithians, found his way back to Mark Antony, who then controlled the eastern part of the Roman Republic. In agreement with his co-ruler Augustus, who controlled the, the western part, the two decided to appoint Herod as king of Judea and sent him away with an army to seize the throne. In 37 BCE, Jerusalem was taken after a siege, and Antigenus was captured and executed. This has been the History of Israel podcast. Check back every Wednesday for new episodes. We are available on Apple, iTunes, Google Podcasts, as well as Spotify. We also have each episode streaming on YouTube. Like, subscribe, comment, and share. We're available on eatmyownbeat.com, as well as the History of Israel podcast on Facebook.